was recording that whole time, but I wasn't. Anyways, I wanted to go ahead and get this video started. First of all, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be filming today because today I am preparing for a very special event. My brother-in-law, Court, is proposing to his girlfriend this Friday. I am so stinking excited and so happy. They're such an awesome couple. I love Jamie. Jamie, if you're watching this, you're a real MVP. I'm so excited. But yeah, we have a lot of planning and preparing to do. So I was going to drink me some coffee and have me a little breakfast really quick and just kind of come up with a to-do list for today because I have some running around that I need to do and I was just gonna take you guys along with me. Let's get started. So a few things that I need to do today, pick up some pictures from CVS. I need to go to Goodwill and some other thrift stores to look for some rugs. Uh, we're gonna try to really go for like the layered rugs kind of look, kind of bohemian, it's very her style. So gonna try and find some, fingers crossed. We have a few days to try and find some, so gonna try and get that done. But yeah, I am very stinking excited. It's gonna be so much fun. I'm gonna get to eating and finishing up my coffee and then we will get on the road and start with all of these errands. So be right back. About to get this day started. Um, I have been group chatting with um, Jamie's mom and sister and trying to work out details. So I'm just so excited. But anyways, I'm about to leave the house right now. So I need to get my stuff together and then we will be heading out. Okay, I've made it to my car. Yeah, right now I'm on my way to CVS. Gonna go pick up those pictures and then hopefully go on to Goodwill. Just got the pictures. They're getting engaged this Friday. Oh, I'm so sticking excited. Okay, but you know what? The weather is so freaking nice right now. I think I'm actually gonna take the top down on my Jeep. Just because it's one of those days, you know? It's just a vibe. <sighs> oh, yeah. That, you guys. That right there is why I bought a freaking Jeep. Because in less than five minutes, I took the top down by myself. And now I can just thrive. Wow, it's so bright. Now to the thrift store to hopefully find some rugs. So that is the next venture. Okay, not looking good. <laughs> so definitely not really anything we would get. And also they're a lot more expensive than I was thinking, so. I'm kind of thinking that Facebook Marketplace is probably going to be our best bet just because like some of these rugs are like 30 bucks and that's how much they are on Facebook Marketplace and I can just find them directly instead of running around all these different thrift stores. So I'm going to try Facebook Marketplace, see my luck. So after the actual proposal, we are going to be at the top, like the entrance area and we're going to be there to like celebrate and be like, yay, congratulations, whatever. And I wanted us all to have like a glass of sparkling grape juice in our hands just because it's like celebratory, you know? And I have like six wine glasses right now, but we need like a total of 15. And so I was gonna try and find cute things like this for everyone to have because my wine glasses that I have right now basically look like this, like the very basic one, but I thought it'd be cute if everyone had like different glasses so I'm gonna just start a little collection and these are only 79 cents each so I'm gonna go ahead and pick these up and then I'm gonna try other thrift stores as well and try and just find basically a bunch of these all right found some goods I'm leaving now and so I've been talking to this lady from my church her name is Christy shout out Christy if you're watching this sister Christy <laughs> and she is basically helping me plan out some stuff and she's gonna actually help me set up the day of which will be a ton of help so I'm really excited about that I found some vases and I'm also going to borrow some vases from other people as well 
In order to keep the cost down, I'm just borrowing stuff from multiple people, uh, people in our church and whatnot. So, so obviously inside was a fail as far as rugs are concerned. I'm actually trying to message with some people now and see if I can possibly go pick up some rugs off of Facebook Marketplace basically. But I'm trying to make sure that they're the right vibe and whatnot. So anyways, I'm just gonna sit here and message some people back and forth real quick to try and hopefully find some. I would say that today was a very successful day. Tomorrow around the time of the proposal, which is about right now, which is like 7.30, 7.15, something like that. I'm actually gonna go to the park, take a look at everything, see how the lighting is looking, kind of see how the decor fits, make sure that there's nothing missing or any empty spots or anything like that. But for the rest of the night, I am just chilling. I'm actually cooking. You probably just saw steam um, hit the, whatchamacallit. I'm gonna do that and enjoy the rest of my night probably go ahead and start editing this vlog honestly just to kind of give myself a head up heads up heads up just to give myself a what is that what am i supposed to say just to give myself a head start <laughs> oh my gosh i can never think of what i'm trying to say i did oh my gosh i don't even think i told you guys I got one of the rugs. I got it for 30 bucks, it was listed for 50, and I talked her down to 30 because we are working on a tight budget here. <laughs> and I picked it up and it's beautiful. It does have some like cat hair on it, so I'm gonna leave it outside and I'm actually gonna just vacuum it very good. I mean, it's gonna be for outside anyways. It's not like we're keeping it for our house or anything like that. Gonna do that, very excited. It's gonna be super duper cute. I think that's pretty much all the updates. Have all of these glass vases, some in here, some in here. Uh, so I have lots of dishes to wash. But anyways, like I said, I'm gonna enjoy dinner, spend the evening with my little boo thing over there. <laughs> he's working right now, so he's distracted. But anyways, I will see you guys bright and early tomorrow morning. Okay, I am officially ready for the day. I kind of feel like I look like a naked mole rat because I never wear my hair like back in a ponytail like this. But to be honest, my hair is very dirty. So we're just gonna kind of hope for the best. And I just didn't really feel like a messy bun today, which is out of the norm for me. But anyways, we're gonna try this, see how it works. If it doesn't work, you know, whatever. Right now, Cody is on the way home and he should be bringing a gimbal for my camera. Um, it's one of our friends. He's letting us borrow it for this weekend so that I can, you know, put together a cute video for them. And so I'm gonna try that out really quick. Then I'm heading straight to Value Village to hopefully, hopefully find another rug. If I can't at Value Village, then I'm gonna um, just Google some more thrift stores near me and just kind of hop around and find some thrift stores, hopefully. And that is the plan for today. I also, around seven o'clock, need to go and um, do like a mock setup for the engagement and just make sure that everything looks right and fits and that the sunset is right and all that good stuff. So gonna be working on that today. Cody is pulling up to the house right now. So let me see really quick if he brought that gimbal. I'll be right back. What's up? What's up? I'm here. All right, just got one less thing from the to-do list today. He came and dropped off that gimbal and everything works perfect. So that's very nice to know. Um, now it, it's actually 323. So I'm gonna hurry up. I'll see you at Value Village, which is also my favorite thrift store, which is also dangerous. But anyways, we'll see what we find. So I'm not really having a ton of luck right now, to be honest. I'm gonna keep looking. Didn't find any rugs so far, but we'll see if I can't find them here in a second. They really, I'm so surprised. They do not have a lot of glassware, like at all. It's so shocking for a thrift store. Okay, I spoke too soon. I turned the corner and here I am. Here is more of what we're looking for. Oh, it has a little chip in it. Uh, this one too, why do they have little chips in them? But this, uh, oh, literally all of them cracked. 
but I might at least get this one. It's the one that has the smallest chip. Really noticeable. Taking this one and moving on to the next thrift store. Here goes attempt number two. It's a good little right down the road. Let's start with the rugs. Fingers crossed. I feel like I can kind of see something, but uh, it's brown and it's tiny. It's gonna be a no for me, dog. Okay, I'm going to, I can't even look at the dresses because the dresses are what get me. I'm having mad self-control. I just want you guys to know that I have not bought myself one thing. Now don't hold me to that. If it is that good, I will most likely buy it, but I haven't yet so far. Doing pretty good, if I do say so myself. Cody would be proud. Let's check out the vases. So here is what I'm looking for, the style, but $1.29 is kind of like, eh, they have them for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. I'm looking for more of like 50 cents, 79 cents, that type of thing. Again, a dollar, a dollar, I don't understand. So far, no to the vases. Let's go over to the wine glasses and see if we have any luck. Okay, this is cute and it's different. I've been needing like a different vibe. Okay, so 79 cents. And these are pretty darn cute and there's three of them. So perfect. I'm gonna keep looking, see what else I can find. Ooh, yes. Okay, I have a feeling but this is gonna be our last time shopping for glasses. I'm just gonna go ahead and claim that, okay? Okay, so I would call that partially successful. No luck in the rugs, um, but I did find four more glasses. I think that's good for the glasses as of right now. I'm gonna chill out on buying them and just focus on rugs. We'll see, we could be hopeful. Okay, there's one more Goodwill near me. It's about 12 minutes away. I think that we can do it. Let's head over to this last and final thrift store of the day. Okay, last thrift store. I'm at another Goodwill. Fingers crossed we find this rug. I can already see the rug cart from here. It's all the way back there. It has a huge one. Obviously not what we're looking for. Feeling hopeful. Let's see, oh, are you kidding? A complete bust. They have so many options for cups and glasses. They have so many more. And look, I already found one. Look how awesome this is. I think that's good for the glasses as of right now. I'm gonna chill out on buying them. I mean, this is totally unique from all the other ones that we have found so far for 99 cents so we are definitely gonna snag this one so a few more that I found this is sort of similar to the one that we just found at the Goodwill but it's a little bit bigger and then I also found these they look pretty cool they're just they're huge so but I like how it's different from everything else that we have so I think I'm gonna leave with these four I'm gonna chill out on buying them. I'm excited, so I, I got some good finds at this one. Just not the rug, which is sad, but oh well, what can I do? I'll just keep looking on Facebook Marketplace. Okay, so that was our last and final Goodwill stop for the day. The last errand that we have to do today is vacuum the rug, which I'll do off camera because that's boring, and then also go to the park and do the mock setup. So that is the next time that you will see me. I'll see you in a second. This is it, you guys. I am at the park and I'm kind of trying to rush. It's 7.23 right now. You know, they're planning on getting here at 7.30 the day of. Of course, this is just like a mock trial, but I have all of this stuff in my car that I'm trying to carry out. Cody was supposed to come with me, but he remembered that he had a Bible study tonight. So, you know, priorities. I'm trying to set you up, there we go. So I'm trying to just shove my purse of all of the stuff that I like need to try out and make sure that it fits good. And then I'll just carry the rug with me. <laughs> wow, this is a lot of stuff. Okay, BRB, I'll take you along once I actually get down to the proposal site. I got the mock setup all done and it's looking so cute. It's making me very, very excited. So let me turn around real quick. Here's the gazebo. 
They're gonna walk underneath and it'll be centered underneath there, but you know, it's just a mock trial, so I don't really need it to be centered. They'll be standing there, obviously. And then over here, we have the twinkle lights wrapped around the pillar. And I'm not sure if you could tell, but it's stringed across all the way and wrapped on this side as well. And there's gonna be pictures of them, like clothes pinned across for, you know, memories or whatever. Then there's gonna be a vase over here with pompous grass. And then underneath all of the twinkle lights and the pictures of clothespins, there's going to be vases with floating candles and then rose petals. So, and it's gonna double on this side too. So it'll be twinkle lights here, going across, going down here as well. And then same thing, the vases with floating candles and rose petals across here. So that is the mock setup. I'm gonna go ahead and tear all of this down. It's working exactly as we sort of envisioned and it's making me so stinking excited. I just cannot wait to get this started and going and yeah. Oh my gosh, I am seriously sweating. It's not even that hot out here, but just walking uphill and upstairs, lugging around that rug was truly a struggle, but it was so worth it. Everything is turning out better than I could have even imagined, honestly. It looks so cute. I think everything else we pretty much get the day of. I think that's pretty much it for today. I'm gonna go home and have some dinner, maybe edit a little bit. Hopefully the next time I see you, it will actually be engagement day and we'll be setting up for everything and getting it all pretty and ready and oh i cannot wait okay i'll see you then you guys today is the stinking day do i have fade eye teeth i don't know but i do need to run into kroger really quick to get some cupcakes and some sparkling grape juice and i believe that is it why do i feel like it's zoomed in is that no, I guess I'm just holding it too close. I am getting so stinking excited, so close to time. I just know that Court is getting more and more nervous. Um, anyways, I'm gonna run in here really quick, get the few things that I need, and then we will be on our way. All right, here goes nothing. Christy is already down there setting up everything but it is actually prom right now. So the park that we're setting up at is just full of young people taking pictures. And it's awesome, it's adorable, it's great. But I just, I feel bad. I feel like we're kind of getting in their way. But anyways, we're just gonna do the best that we can. And my car is extremely loud, so you probably can't hear anything I'm saying. Love that. Okay, BRB. Okay. So time to catch you up a little bit. So they came early, like 15 minutes early, which was detrimental, just a little bit. But basically I couldn't film very much behind the scenes of setting up because we were just running so low on time. I had to prioritize. So we got everything set up, obviously. Everything turned out just breathtaking, honestly. Like perfect better than i even thought it was going to seriously shout out to christy thank you so much for helping me really you were just the icing on the cake like you made this happen you're amazing and i could go on for days but anyways i love you so much and thank you but anyways everything turned out perfect so cute they're engaged she said yes yeah i mean i guess that's all that really matters right they're engaged like i have a future sister-in-law now what the heck? I'm so stinking excited. Look at the happy couple. I can't tell, they're so cute.
day is coming to an end. I've said it a million times, but wow, everything turned out so perfect. We are now out to eat. We're at a Mexican restaurant just to kind of celebrate and hang out a little bit. I think that this is probably where I'm gonna go ahead and close the vlog out. Um, I just wanted to say one more time, a huge congratulations to Court and Jamie. I am so freaking excited to have another girl in the family, another sister-in-law. You're amazing, Jamie. I could not have chosen someone better for Court. You guys are absolutely perfect for each other and I'm so excited about your future. But anyways, I'm gonna go in there and hang out with you. So good night, you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your week. Thank you so much for tuning in again. I will see you next week. Bye.